Thanks for rolling up to Bill Morley and his certified pothead. Rolling up one of my morning jays and shit. Um, you know what we getting ready to do, bro. Get jump in, get ready to jump in and see uh what happened in the world of weed and shit. And let's uh let's go ahead and jump in, bro. Well, with the start of a new month, new laws were passed during the legislative session are now taking effect. NBC Local 33, Zach Lamy is live at the Capitol with a breakdown of some of these laws that will impact you. Good morning, Zach. Who are we at? We are in, uh, did they say Louisiana? Uh, did Louisiana pass any weed laws? Is, is this Louisiana? Let's check it out. Hey, good morning, Corey and Reggie. Well, Governor John Bell Edwards enacted more than 700 new laws after this last legislative session, and some of those laws actually have to do with the state's medical marijuana program. So to start, it is no longer operated solely under the Department of Agriculture. Now the Department of Health is taking over and extending some of those responsibilities to the Department of Revenue and the Board of Pharmacy. And with less than 10 medical marijuana dispensaries, Many participating in the program have complained about the lack of access. So another law expands the number of pharmacies allowed to operate within the state. In the past, police could use the smell of marijuana as a cause to search a home, but now they are only able to conduct a related warrantless search if marijuana is visible. And some law enforcement officials are saying that they're not sure how they can enforce the law. Uh, I don't know where I don't know where this is at. It seemed like they put they put a bunch of new uh, laws on the books in whatever uh, state this is from, and and some of them some of them are good. Some of them are good, like you know what I mean you can't just just come to my crib. You smell you smell weed coming out my house. You can't just come in and search my crib. You got to be able to actually see marijuana. That's that's a good that's that's good. I'm sure there's other uh, laws like that that are in the, on the books now. So 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 yeah. Uh, Legislative sessions, you know what I mean, when they when they turn over and start introducing new laws that, that uh go into place. Some of them can help, some of them some of them can be be a nuisance. I guess to the legislators or does that since your vehicle is considered an extension of your home, does that negate the vehicle too? Uh I don't know. Does that mean that um they can't search your search your car for smell of weed. I know there are some states that are um are are saying that saying that you can't just search cars just because you smell weed because you can't tell by the smell of weed whether somebody got you know a prescription prescription bag or you know what I mean a black market bag. Now, smoking or vaping marijuana in a vehicle while on state highways and roadways is still illegal, and drivers who violate that law will receive fines and citations for a non-moving violation, which will not affect their driving record. Now, there are a ton of new laws going to affect today, so we'll be sure to have more information available on our website and on our free BR Proud app. But for now, reporting live from the Capitol, Zach Labe, NBC Local 33 News. All right, so, so, uh... You got some new laws going down somewhere. I did, I still have not even even uh I don't even remember where he said this shit was from. It's well, Baton Rouge. Okay, so this is Louisiana. So Louisiana got some new laws on the books, man. Um uh make sure y'all pay attention to those. If you don't know what they are, go go to whatever this website is and, and look them up, man, because uh you don't want to be caught slipping on some shit and um you may you may just find out that uh there's some shit you are allowed to do now. That you wasn't allowed to do yesterday, my dude. 